a I couple know. of weeks. We were saying it's been a while. Yeah, so we're really excited to be back together again. And we've got some um, pieces which are available all to shop now as we speak to you guys. So mm -hmm. there's actually a handbag icon in the bottom part of the screen, which you can tap on and it will showcase all of the pieces that we are showcasing today. And also in the top left hand corner above my head here, there will be icons and there, there'll be images of the pieces that we're showing. These are actually interactive buttons. You can click on them. It will take you straight through to the website so you can see further images and details of all of the products mm -hmm. as well so we have an array of many different designers today from chanel dior balenciaga so all the fun pieces we have today including shoes as well can you sing our theme tune <laughs> <laughs> i came up with a theme tune oh my god i'm gonna do it ready it's really catchy <laughs> welcome to the grace and Charlie show <laughs> Oh, good. Sade came up with a theme tune for us and Let's, I actually love it. So I, love I think we should it. record it and actually make yeah. this a thing. Yeah, so welcome. <laughs> I'm, not, welcome I'm not doing that again. So. Okay, let's start, let's start. Um, I love this actually. This is the first time seeing this bag and when we got it here, I just wanted to point this out straight away. So I love tweed and it's that kind of, um, it's got like a coating on top of it, but it is tweed. It's got the Balenciaga logo to the front. Now for me, we see everybody wearing the city style tote style. This is slightly different, but still has that kind of boxiness, what the modern ones have now. Now, as you can see, I'm wearing it as a top handle, but it also has that handy little um, detachable strap and you can wear it as a crossbody. Condition, there literally is nothing to really to point out. The corners are nice and clean. The body of the bag is excellent. And then it just has a really nice clean interior. And considering it's such a small bag, it is quite spacious. Yeah, so I really love I really love this. And the reason why is because it's quite a classic shape and style and it's it's pink but it's not too pink mm. so you kind of get that hint of pink with that tweed but also that nice black leather as well tones it down so yeah a nice subtle way to add a bit of color into your wardrobe definitely as Charlie said it's in a great condition and this is available for 395 pounds and it will come included with a luxury promise authenticity card and a luxury promise um dust bag as well hey beverly hi thank Bev. you <laughs> for tuning in so I am going to go with um, another small um, style of bag. I'm going to move on to Celine and this is a real classic uh, design from the house of Celine. Um, it's known as the micro luggage bag mm -hmm. and the luggage was actually designed by Phoebe Philo. I think it was part of her era when she was creative director of Celine and um, it became an ultimate it bag of the se of like the season. So this is considered an it bag and a classic and one to definitely own in your wardrobe. Wardrobe. Um, it has a really nice design to it. It's kind of got this like um, nice design with the leather to the front. It's paired with the yellow gold hardware. Um, it's black smooth leather and it's got small top handles which do just about mm. fit on the wrist. Um, it kind of sits the similar to like a Birkin 25, yeah. kind of like just on the wrist, but it's still quite a comfortable wear. Um, it also has a detachable crossbody strap as well, and the length of that sits nicely just below the hip. It looks as well. really good for your outfit. That black blazer with the touch of grey. Yeah, it's just such a chic. This reminds me of like a Paris bag. Like, yeah, you it's can just make a classic. It's, yeah. it's a real classic. It's classy, it's chic, and it just fits all of your small essentials that you need for the for the day. There is some um, some signs of wear to the base of the bag, but overall it's in a good condition. Um, it's been factored into the pricing that the interior is slightly more worn, and this is available for 495 really good price. A great price, and considering these resell for around $750 um, upwards, um, it's a really great price for a Celine luggage bag as well. Mm. So guys, you can actually see the icons in the top left-hand corner here. If you are new, then these icons are buttons that you can click on tap that and it will take you straight through to the website to purchase the products that we're showing definitely now we're doing contrast of colors right now so we've gone from black to this incredibly um loud but proud <laughs> epi leather pouch now we all know how hot these bright lime lemon kind of kind of colors are at the moment and this is one of those pieces that i think is so useful to have in your wardrobe yeah. definitely use it as like a, a cosmetic pouch as as is in the name mm -hmm. but i would definitely use this more as like an organizer inside a bag yeah. also yeah. then you can quick easily kind of rummage out your keys your cars your cash because it's a nice bright color now for me epi leather is one of my favorite leather 
um, just because it's so durable, but then it has that kind of texture to it, which I absolutely love with it. Mm -hmm. Now, the condition of this, again, is absolutely beautiful. There's no signs of wear really to the body or the corners. Now, this is £300 does come with its dust bag and as you can see it's so nice and spacious as well it's nice and clean inside and i, I wonder if it would fit a big phone inside Maybe. okay it would guys yeah. so this is the the 11 to, or 12 max it's the big big phone um, and it fits a phone in as well so this is a really nice way if you're traveling as well if you're one of those people like I'm, i packed last night obviously for my holiday yeah. and i i've packed this massive bag i end up traveling with like two magazines three books <laughs> this that the other just in my hand luggage so something like this i always have because you can put all of the important little things inside and you know they're all together so i find yeah. stuff like this so useful love this yeah this and reminds me amazing. also of like um, right. um amani mood i can't even say her name <laughs> amina Mawadi. <laughs> amina Mawadi. Kind of yeah, colors, the colour is like her. lime, like the um, as yeah. lime colour. And I always describe epi leather as like a wave. A wave. Um, hey, Kel, thank you for tuning in. And nice to see you or speak with you, <laughs> kind of. Um, so I am going to go for. What are you going to do next? Should I'm going to go bit of Louis. for some Louis. Yeah. So I'm going to go for this style of crossbody bag. So this is um, a nice everyday crossbody piece. It's crafted from Louis Vuitton's iconic coated canvas um, and has that Louis Vuitton monogram design, which we all love and we all recognize. So this is a real classic statement piece. The bag is kind of like a rectangular shape, slightly thinner. So um, again, great for small essentials. It would fit a phone or two if you have two in like me <laughs> yeah. um, the inside is really nice and clean and it's just a great bag for day and night you can actually remove the strap as well so you can use it as a clutch bag or like a wallet inside us mm. again inside a bigger bag um, but the length of the strap is um, probably one of my favorite lengths when it sits just above oh, the hip that. And yeah, I mean, Louis Vuitton, the, the monogram is so classic and is known by everybody. So this is just a real true classic yeah. piece. It's a vintage and it fits all of your small essentials in. The condition is great. Yeah. Um, and it, it's uh, 515 pounds. Now, Beverly, this would definitely fit um, small documents in. Yeah. It would fit a passport in as well. So again, it could be a great document holder inside a bigger bag. Again, another piece that's just has so many different uses and wears. And I, that's exactly why I love this so much. So it's 515 pounds. Mm -hmm. Um, and you could even probably shorten the strap as well if you wanted yeah. to, to create. And this is what I call yeah. a really useful bag. There's so many different ways yeah. you can wear it for. Exactly. Um, and it's just really practical. Look how nice yeah. that looks even as a top exactly. handle. Exactly. You can just transform it to, in loads of different ways and styles. Yeah. So a really, really good Looking piece. at it like that is kind of the alternative to the pochette. Now yeah. we all know the classic Louis Vuitton pochette. These are actually sold out from Louis Vuitton. So we do always try and source them, especially the vintage ones. Now again, it's kind of got that usefulness as the yeah. previous bag has, but you don't have that kind of crossbody. But for me, these are such a great bag for day and evening. Mm -hmm. um, you can like wear it in so many different ways. Again, it's got that coated canvas monogram, which I absolutely love. Now this is, what's the price of this one? This is £495, so a really, really great price. We're actually seeing an um, increase in the price that people are advertising these for now. like And an increase in demand. In demand, Everybody yeah. is coming into the store and asking for these Louis Vuitton pochettes. And what I've really noticed is it's like that Gen Z young girl. Yeah. Like, it's kind of like that introduction bag into the luxury world. So, I, like, I would get this for my sister or if you're, like, just leaving uni or, you know, school. I think it's such a perfect yeah. piece. But also... A classic if you need just a small pochette for an evening as Isn't well. Isn't it? Yeah. Can't go wrong with these and you know they will not date at all. It will yeah. be in your wardrobe for an absolute lifetime. An investment piece as well. Yeah, definitely. So let's stick with Louis Vuitton. I feel like we'll go through all of the monograms yeah. that we've got. And I have a um, Louis Vuitton pouch, which again is in this coated canvas, which has actually been around for so many years. The coated canvas is historically known to be really durable and hard wearing. So Louis Vuitton pieces, one thing we love about them is they're specifically designed to be really hard wearing and last you a lifetime. Mm -hmm. um, so something like this, you purchase once and you use forever. It's almost like an heirloom piece, I would yeah. say. Um, and this is designed specifically to be a 
wash bag. But again, it's really Oh, I would wear well. this in the evening. Me too, bag, exactly. I just think this is, it's a kind of softer bag. So it kind of, you know, it molds and it's slouchy and it's quite a relaxed finish. Yeah. You can hold it as a clutch bag. Again, you can use it inside bigger bags, traveling, wash bags, makeup bags, you name it. Mm. Um, but yeah, I agree. I think this could make a really perfect clutch bag. Mm. And it, although I find the Louis Vuitton monogram stands out quite a lot, it also is quite a yeah. neutral. I could never yeah. no, I agree describe with you. why. I always say that because it's so bold and in your face, you can just match it with anything. Everything. Though, like you could wear stripes of this and it would look absolutely yeah. fine. It must be the where, color. Yeah, and I, where I feel like the Gucci GG is a bit harder to kind of match. Yeah, I agree. I think this is a great piece, yeah. really versatile and useful. And this is available for three hundred and eighty-five pounds. Also, I heard I might need to ask Springer about this, or if anybody mm -hmm. on here knows that they're discontinuing the mon the canvas. They are. They are. Oh, yeah. The canvas. Yeah. So I I knew that they were discontinuing the the toiletry pouches. Yeah. You know, but I the think ones the canvas in the general they're just doing leather now. Apparently, I heard. They, I feel like they're almost going backwards in time. Yeah. By doing that. <laughs> yeah. Like, why would you start using leather now? when you don't use leather and but everyone's going against leather. Could you imagine that happened? I might have to, oh my God, I'd buy stocks and shares in monogram bags. Could <laughs> you imagine? You heard it here first, guys. Yeah. <laughs> um, so again, this I think this is our last Louis Vuitton monogram piece now. This is my favourite shaped bag. Yeah. Favourite, favourite out of everything. The ellipse bag. I think it's so unique. It's so different. It's a true vintage beauty. Although it has that kind of structure to it, mm. it can fit quite a lot in it again. This is in the MM size. So for me, my favourite size, my favourite shape. I love a monogram print. Mm. Again, it does have that darkening to the handles, but it's a vintage. So... That's um, kind of what we love about them. Mm. Now you, know, you you go into Louis Vuitton sh uh, shops now, and yeah. I, I know from her, I did it with my friend the other day. She bought a keeple bag, yeah. And obviously, we're so used to seeing all of like the vintage pieces with the like the worn out corners yeah. and the brown patina leather. And she bought this like brand spanking new keeple bag, and the leather is like actually pink. Yeah, I don't like like that. it's pink. No, this is yeah, it's so much. More I don't like that pink leather that they first come yeah. out like. So four hundred and twenty pounds, a great price. Who knows, it might be worth next year £100,000 if um, Louis Vuitton discontinues. But I must say, this is a good price because these go for around £800 yeah. anyway. So whoever yeah. bought this in that cheap... I know, I don't actually know why it's that price. <laughs> so a really good steal. And yeah. it's that unique shape that you won't see anybody wearing, which I love about it. Um, it doesn't come with a strap because I can see it's got little loops here for a strap. Um, but you definitely could buy one um, from Louis Vuitton. We actually, I think we have some available on our website. I'm going to hold you here with this bag mm -hmm. and I'm going to move on to the Twilly because okay. we've got one pre-loved Hermes Twilly bag that, um, Twilly, Twilly, oh, not Twilly you... bag, um, Twilly that we have as part of today's drop. Um, so we very rarely get um, pre-owned Twillies. We usually get them, you know, with the full set and people just buy them so they can get the bags. But um, yeah, we've got this one and it's actually got, um, it's decorated in dogs. Oh wow. And it's really cute. Look, oh, it's I love so that. cute. So you've got loads of different, um, I was going to say styles of dogs, but I mean breeds, <laughs> breeds of dogs on one side. And then you've got this kind of like aztec -y design, um, triangle design on the other side. I am obsessed. Yeah, right. It's so nice. Now this has got a mixture of kind of like the bronze tones and the um, like rouge vive colours throughout. But Twillies aren't only made for Hermes bags and Twillies can be made, it can be used in so many different ways. For example, like on a Louis Vuitton bag, you've got that classic monogram. And then if you do want to style it up, I, I'm like terrible at tying these, but if you yeah. want to add a bit of color on it, you can How so cute. easily. Um, and yeah, it just brings me on to the point of Hermes Twillies can be used in so many different yeah. ways, not just for Hermes bags. You can even tie them kind of like around your ponytail yeah. and they look really cute. Yeah. I love them for a little splash of color. I always say, neck. yeah, because if, yeah. if if you know your kind of colour that suits you for your face, if you don't I know mean, what... red is your colour. Yeah, but people keep saying red's my colour. But so if you is. kind of don't know what to wear on a, definitely a grey day like this, get a twilly that is really good for your skin tone, wrap it around your neck and then it just brightens your whole face up. Yeah. So I think they're very useful for that as well, just to kind of... Yeah. Exactly. Um, so this is £125. It will come with a Luxury Promise dust bag. Um, and yeah, you can use this in so many different ways. And a Twilly is designed to last you a lifetime. It's something you'll have in your wardrobe forever. They're never really going to go out of fashion because you can style them up and, yeah. and use them in different ways. So this is £125. Yeah.
Love so it. we've got two, um, <coughs> sorry, we've got two <laughs> Kavon wallets today in today's drop. Now, who remembers when these came out? I absolutely love them. So as you can see, I've got the one here in black and it's got that beautiful contrasting pink interior, which this is, is so iconic and that lovely CC and paint to the side. Now, this is just a classic long wallet shape. You can fit cash, coins, cards. It's even documents probably yeah. what we would probably carry it for now because we don't really carry cash do we and um it's in that gorgeous soft lambskin leather like they don't make the leather like this anymore no they don't it's so buttery soft it's incredible yeah and if you like something a bit smaller then we've got uh, this one in beige which is absolutely gorgeous again it's in lambskin it's got the same kind of compartments coins cash cards it comes with its um mm. chanel dust um chanel card actually which is really really handy and they they both they both come with their boxes as well so this comes with a chanel box the other one comes with its chanel box as well um so christmas Christmas is coming. Christmas is coming. Oh, home. Grace is the Grinch. She's like, <laughs> why is everybody playing Christmas I am, music? I am such a Grinch. Who remembers the days when Christmas did not exist until December 1st? Because <laughs> that, that, that's, that's what I was used to. Honestly, the streets are like so festive. I know. Right? I'm, not, I'm not here God, for it. Because yeah, even really. like we were oh, saying, oh, oh. even we're trying to do content for obviously Luxury Promise, but we don't want to have it Christmas yet. And it's so hard not to get Christmas decorations. Beverly. Beverly. Stop with the Christmas emoji. <laughs> shall yeah, we, shall we block Ben? <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> yeah, I'm not yet there, but if you guys are super organised, I have started Christmas shopping. Have you? Yeah, I have. See, I haven't. Yeah, I have. I've started Christmas shopping and these would make perfect gifts. I mean, who wouldn't want for me 1st of November straight up? Kel. Oh, Kel. <laughs> Oh no. no, I'm not there. I'm sorry. Maybe give me a week and I might be there. Rachel's yeah. like, woo. Like end of November yeah. is acceptable for me. Yeah. But so yeah, these September. would make these would make great Christmas presents. Anything with a box, I think people really appreciate as gifts. Yeah. Obviously, we have our luxury promise um, gift boxes now for all orders over a thousand pounds. But I mean, who wouldn't want to receive a Chanel box exactly. under the tree this year? So these are in the top right. Uh, sorry, left hand corner, just here. You can click the icons and see further images and descriptions. But our wallet's such a great present because yeah. it just lasts you forever. Definitely. Mm. Speaking of presents, I am going to go on to a gorgeous and unique Chanel necklace, which I personally love. Um, it's in like a dark palladium hardware and it features a, like a half moon crescent with the CC logo to the end. I think it's so, so gorgeous. You could either wear this every day because I think it would go with, with everything, but it could be more of a statement necklace as well. It's in an excellent condition. All the diamantes are present. Nothing's missing. It looks absolutely gorgeous. And again, another perfect Christmas present present with its box um rachel's gonna just pop the price up for this but i believe it's 490 pounds it is 490 pounds and you even get the chanel flower on the box as well just to finish it off i am okay obsessed. santa can bring me this yes please santa <laughs> thank you very much how incredible is this so it is i was trying it on in the corner too i was like is it a choker it's definitely a bracelet so <laughs> it's um a bracelet with all those little charm detailings how adorable is that this is so so gorgeous. this is what i love most about this as well it's a mod it's a modern piece but it feels very 90s yeah and that's is and, it modern yeah it's a modern okay, cool. piece yeah it's yeah. not vintage yeah um, or is it, no, it's not vintage. Know, it's Let me see. Winnie buy. Anything Winnie buys is always, yeah, it's usually it might be, vintage. It, it might be, I think it's like a late 90s, mm. maybe. Uh, Let's let Charlotte check it. I'm trying to check <laughs> the year. I haven't got my glasses on. <laughs> it's gorgeous. But it's gorgeous. I don't think it is vintage, vintage, but it might be like early 2000s. But this is super rare as yeah. well. Like that charm detailing. It says Chanel across it. I think there's like two Chanel. Yes, so um, nice. I, I would put this around my ankle. What? With that a pair of heels. Oh yeah. With a pair of like, imagine like white stilettos and that around your ankle. It would look absolutely gorgeous. Yeah, so nice. Yeah, it's so, so pretty. And this is available for 1995 So I assume this is a vintage with the 24 karat gold at that price, I think. Yeah. Comes with a box again. So all of these pieces make absolutely great gifts. Um, and it's something with all of the Chanel logos and diamond um, and like dangly things, what do you call them? <laughs> Charms. Oh, like <laughs> is a really, really rare find. Um, so yeah, that's a great thing. Uh, I've also got more Chanel accessories. This is incredible. So this is a necklace. I'm like trying to 
Okay, wow. so this is like this reminds me of the the belts that we sell regularly with yeah. the with the extra drop chain to it, but it's actually a necklace. How elegant is that? That is so so beautiful. Wow. This definitely is a piece that I would I would wear it day and evening. It's yeah. not too bold and statement for the daytime, but it's just got that really sweet kind of Chanel logo here, and then you've also got the Chanel charm at the back. But for me, it's the CC logo. I'm trying to. So the CC logo here and that uh, chain drop, I think is absolutely stunning. It's so gorgeous. And this is the piece that you just won't see anybody wearing. Is it leather entwined? Yeah, it's leather entwined. It comes so it's with got its that, box. It's got that chain that like the Chanel Classic Flaps has with the leather entwined chain. It's absolutely stunning. Oh, so this is like the clasp of a yeah, bag. the back plate. Oh, that's the thing. back plate of a bag. Of, yeah. yeah. Wow, that's so cool. Here we go, guys. So you see this part here on the back part of the um, turn lock style under the it's flap? Like, yeah, yeah exactly. under the flap. It's absolutely stunning. And it's under £800. Yeah. It's really, really beautiful. So this is 795 Comes with its box. So many nice gifts, actually, today. Yeah. I hope someone's watching for me. <laughs> <laughs> absolutely love this. It's so pretty. Oh, love that. Um, okay, you um, need to do this because I feel like this is oh, going to look yeah. so cute. Oh, yeah. I don't wear headbands really anymore. Headbands, I know. headbands remind me of you. I know, I need to start wearing them again. This is a Chanel headband. Oh, guys. <gasps> okay, I've fallen in love. Oh, oh. It's so cute. It just makes me happy. Headbands, how can headbands not make you happy? So, <laughs> so this is a Cold. Chanel bow detailing headband. How cute is that? Oh, with a little tweed outfit. It really oh, suits you. I'm like, it really, really suits so, you. and I love it because it's not in your face Chanel, but you know it's a Chanel. Yeah. It's got that luxurious kind of satin to it. And you've got the Chanel um, little tag here, comes with its box. Again, this is a beautiful little present for somebody as well. Yeah. Oh, I love this. You could wear this in so many different ways. And it, yeah. I think it is, apart from it going on my head, it looks like it's kind of unworn. Yeah. Really nice condition. There's no freds or pulls on it. Um, oh, it's adorable. <laughs> <laughs> this is available for £280. Really good pounds. price. Uh, again, it comes with its box, so all of these are great gifts. Yes, yeah. I really, really love all of these Should we do some bags? I'm going to go to Prada. Are you? Yes. So, I bought this in from a lovely lady who she'd only bought, uh, she'd only worn it once. Um, she bought this, I believe, for like £1,200 from the store. No way. Yeah, it's a current season Prada re-edition, the nylon re-edition collection, around £1,200 retail. Um, obviously, I've priced it really, really well <laughs> um, and really, really cheap for you guys. Um, so it's black nylon. It's paired with palladium hardware and it's got kind of like black paint and leather detailing to the handles and across the body of the bag. It comes with a detachable canvas strap, which is adjustable. And it's just the perfect size mm. tote, it really is. I don't think it would quite fit a laptop in, but it would fit like an iPad or a tablet and would just make a great oh, everyday tote bag. It's such an easy bag. You actually forget how expensive, Not, I mean, we know it's a designer, so it's expensive, yeah. but because we deal with so much vintage, Prada that looks current yeah and you're like whoa that's two grand and yeah. we're, we're selling it for 400 whatever pounds yeah, exactly you forget yeah. um so definitely buying Prada pre-love for me yeah is the only way yeah so I mean the inside is absolutely stunning it's in that nice nylon it's just a great everyday tote style bag this would have retailed for over £1,200. It's been used literally once and it's available for £750. So a great price. Mm -hmm. um, and just a nice classic bag. It's in that nylon, so designed to be really yeah. durable and hard wearing and great for uh, this horrible London weather. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, um, uh, £750 and the icon is in the top left hand corner. Mm -hmm. it's hmm? That's part of today's as well. So you're wearing one today, aren't you, Grace? I am wearing How one. funny is that? Do you want to do it next? Yeah. Okay. This is fun. Have we got a oh, we got a second bag to kind of We could do We'll show it on your bag. So okay. um how fun is I didn't how fun I didn't even know you had this. So Did you know? No, so Grace is actually wearing it today in khaki, but we have this Fendi shoulder bag, um, detachable. How nice is that? To me it feels a bit military. I mean, that's my style, right? Yeah. Um, this is something I've had for like f three or four years. I I actually, it's Fendi, but I actually put it on my Dior saddle because why not? Um, and it's a, so it's a phone holder. So um, good. And it's so easy, like easily accessible. So I'll, I'll 
put it on in on, oh, in my nice. car but it sits like across the body you can fit a phone i think you can fit two phones in here i think i fit both my phones in and you can click it onto any bag it doesn't have to be yeah. just fendi like this is a perfect example you can pair fendi with dior or fendi with gucci or prada like you can just put this with everything mm. um it would look really nice on you know the prada new nylon prada pochette bags yeah it would look amazing on one of those is how i see it styled but it's just a really easy nice way to hold your phone close to you um I and it's actually them. quite a statement that without being in yeah. your face with that big um phone holder at the yeah. front i love this yeah it's so practical but looks really cool and like you said it's yeah. that military oversized kind of style it comes with, with a dust, dust bag, bag that we love and i think i paid around i think i paid around 700 for mine oh yeah which is just crazy but um we've got this one for 350 so wow, half, price. half price um yeah there we silly go. old me hey <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay rachel's favorite is up i there. love this bag Let's see rachel's favorite so and Kel, guys, I'm glad you like that. Honestly, this is my favourite ever bag strap, like, ever. I yeah. literally love it. And that price is so, so good. So we're moving on to a classic Dior, which I didn't know much about until the last couple of months, mm. until I saw literally everybody wearing it. Really? Everybody loving it. I love it. the bobby bag. Such a nice it's my bag. my favourite style at the moment. Yeah, so it's a nice... It smells good. Oh, it's like... Smells like nice leather. Um, it's like a nice classic crossbody style bag in soft, um, soft brown leather and paired with yellow gold hardware. It's adjustable and it can be worn crossbody, but I think it's just because you've got yeah. the buttons here. That's okay. So it can be worn as a crossbody. The um, I think actually it can be worn as a clutch as well. So the strap yeah. can actually be removed. There's a magnetic pop lock buckle to the front, and it's in that box like fabric, mm. like leather, that so really luxurious. nice, soft, shiny leather. It's got the montane detailing to the back, which I just love, and it's just really, really beautiful. Like um, Rachel's saying, it's like a caramel color, which we all know has been in over the last year and it's definitely carrying on into winter. Yeah, um, it's just a classic bag, a really beautiful classic bag. It, I think it's barely even been used apart from us trying it on to show you, and it's available for 2,250. I believe the retail price on these is around two thousand eight hundred. Yes, two seven. Two seven, exactly. Yeah. So you're saving around five hundred pounds mm. shopping with us today, guys. The color is classic. I need to see yeah. this on you. Yeah, I love this bag. Honestly, my so favorite nice. bag at the moment, just because I love it. My it's simple. Bag. <laughs> well, it's my favorite bag. <laughs> it's I love simple. It. It's classic. I love gold on camel. I think yeah. it's so special. Um, and it's just that traditional kind of saddle style that you just know will never date. Yeah. It's and I think it has been... Piece. So I, um, I bought this off a client who um, regularly sells to us. She buys it and then gets bored, wears it once. So she's literally worn this bag once, guys. So almost box fresh. Um, actually, I have this tote bag here, which is very um, for today's weather. This now... Isn't it? Yeah. It's, um, it's that really on trend kind of shearling that we saw through the summer, but has carried on to the winter. Um, and this is a Christian Dior. I believe this is it's a quite an old style from about two thousand and two, but it feels so modern. It does, doesn't it? Because yeah. of that shearling, because of that kind of slouchy um, yeah. vibe to it. Now, again, considering the age, it's in an absolutely stunning condition. It's got a very clean interior, and you just want to like s snuggle it. Yeah, it looks so warm and snuggly. But imagine this with like a uh, Max Mara teddy jacket. Yeah. Wearing this, you've got your your knee high boots. Um, a really really great bag. Um, it could probably potentially. Uh, I don't think it would fit a laptop in it, but you definitely could fit a lot in it. And then you've got that Christian Dior charm detailing. I reckon it would. Do you think? Yeah, I reckon it would. You'd slip it in through the, like like that and into the into the corner. Wow, you heard it yeah, here. I oh yeah, because it, it stretches. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, we'll get a laptop in there. Yeah. The perfect soft style tote bag. Yeah, the co it's a cozy bag. Yeah, <laughs> but you could even so you can take the straps off through the loops and wear it as a really large oversized slouchy clutch. Yeah, which is really in at the moment. Yeah, and I know you're loving this look. I know I'm it's loving this look. It's such a good look. look. Yeah. it really is. Uh, it reminds me of that. We've spoke about it before when Victoria Beckham that like, grabbed the yeah. big Chanel bag on, under her arms. I love it. Love it. So two items that are slightly smaller. Um, oh, I'm going to pass you one. Um, so mini mini pouches and yeah. pochettes and papillon bags are a great great pieces to invest in. They're classics, 
but if you are looking to start a luxury collection if you're someone slightly younger or want something small and classic then these are great pieces to invest in especially with the Dior um, saddle pouch if you don't want to be spending around 1500 pounds upwards for a pre loved yeah. saddle then this one is like just a smaller version but it still has the same classic sh um, silhouette of a Dior mm -hmm. saddle it's crafted from um, a bleak coated canvas and it's finished with gold hardware it's got a very small very feminine leather strap as well which would sit nicely over the arm if i wasn't wearing this humongous blazer uh, it does fit nicely hey sabrina hi sabrina <laughs> um so yeah a great piece to um you know purchase it's a nice evening bag yeah. small everyday piece and this is available for 580 <laughs> and what is great about this kind of bag it's one of those pieces that is going to be in fashion as it is it's now a, it's a you're then gonna give it to your children your children are gonna wear it your children children mm. it's just gonna do an absolute 360 as yeah. the style as we have seen has done that's so scary to think i'll be giving my saddle bags to my child yeah and they're Aww. gonna be like oh mum and then a year yeah. later it's gonna be the hottest thing again um and then also with the mini bags again we have a very classic piece it's the louis vuitton papillon in that epi leather which is like a waterfall yeah um and it's actually really rare to get the papillon in black i very yes. rarely see them in black they come in reds a lot and yellows and greens but to get a classic black one i haven't seen so definitely whoever wants a papillon get it because it's so rare in black it's got that gold hardware which i think works so great against the the base color of the bag and again it's just really sweet you can't really fit much in there but who cares you know it's a great do, little but... accessory you can wear it as a little charm <laughs> <laughs> It looks so cool. Yeah, like this. it's a really good choice because they you have the larger papillon as well. You can do it like that. Don't you? yeah. I oh. mean, how oh. cute! Oh. Okay, the mini papillon is my favourite bag charm ever. Love, <laughs> I, so I cute. love it. I think it looks so cute. Um, and yeah, that whole layering effect with like the leather and the nylon, I think, is a really cool look as well. Yeah. We've got lots of mini bags today. And then we've got this little Gucci mini um, Boston bag, which I absolutely love. The Boston bags came out in the 70s, so I have been around for a long, 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 long time. And it's in that coated canvas, which I absolutely love. And then it gives it kind of more of a jazzy evening feel with yeah. the silver leather handles, which I absolutely love. Um, and again, this is a top handle. You couldn't wear it as a funky little charm, but I think this is big enough to wear. Um, we've, you've got a giant yes you could wear it as a charm but i love this piece it can fit in all your items that you need like your wallets your lipsticks and so on and i think this is just a funky real throwback to kind of the early 2000s and then you've got that gg monogram throughout so i love this bag it reminds me of like stormy 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 oh, yeah she would wear that she yeah. wore that to school yeah <laughs> Stormy. Stormy. <laughs> no, not Stormzy. Imagine <laughs> Stormzy. Like I, 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 I would rock this to school as well. <laughs> <laughs> so the next bag, I had no idea what brand it was until I felt those iconic handles. Yeah. Those bamboo top handles that are such a statement for the Gucci house. Paint and leather, I think, is a great leather to go for in the winter. I think it just gives that sparkle to a look. And this is like a nice soft tote style bag with these black bamboo Love handles. This. It's paired with a nice like champagne -y gold hardware. Um, it's a soft tote, so kind of like a nice comfortable wear. It would definitely fit a laptop in. It's a good enough size and is in an excellent condition, to be honest. Yeah. It looks really, really amazing. There's some light wear to the base, but nothing, considered, um, nothing significant at all to mention. Um, it's got a big zipper across the top and the price is even better it's 200 and is that even right is that 200 pounds yeah, yeah. it's 220 pounds guys Ooh. and gucci have recently relaunched their bamboo haven't they the bamboo top panel yeah style. so it's a super on trend style at the moment yeah um, I, really I know nice. I always say the story every time I say a bamboo handle, but Harry Styles wore uh, a classic bamboo, what was it, was it a Jackie, Jackie bag? Yeah. How, I mean, how iconic is that? I love yeah. that. Um, but yeah, love this bag. And I love painting at the moment me as well. Me too, I love it. I think yeah, it's so Yeah, I never so used nice. to like it, but it reminds me now of that kind of, I'm going to say sexy. Yeah. Like that really sexy kind of wear uh, yeah. a, a Mac with coat, like a yeah. big coat, Mac coated with a patent bag, some boots in the winter. And you've got that kind of yeah. winter, rainy chic. day, chic look. 
I know what you mean. Yeah. I love it. I'm, I'm glad you know what I mean. I get, I get you. I get you. <laughs> Um, again, another great little Christmas present, or you can just treat yourself to a wallet. It's that Balenciaga motocross style bag, but it's that modern version of the motocross. Now, this is £200, so a really great price. Again, the condition of it is absolutely beautiful. It's in that really easy to match and wear grey, grey colour. Um, and I love that against the silver toned hardware. It makes it look almost a little bit icy. Now, I was checking yeah, I as... Um, I think I put in the description icy blue. Did you? Yeah. <laughs> You should hear us in the office when we get something in and we're like, what colour is this? And we're all giving our input yeah. on the colour. We come up with some, um, yeah, weird ones. Yeah. But I was just checking, it doesn't have any loops throughout as a wallet on chain, but you could get a little chain, loop it under, and wear it as like a little crossbody wallet on chain as well for the evening. So really great piece and a beautiful condition. So I think, Karen, if I re read correctly, you're looking for the Dior tote bag. Um, I'm hoping it's this one that this we've one. got, and I feel like you showed this so well. Thanks. But um, so this is the Dior Tote style bag that we've got, and Chade was saying how on trend the shearling look is at the moment. We've seen it in like Chanel, we've seen it in Hermes, um, and this is gorgeous. It's in like this mauvey, purpley yeah. tone, but it's got the carnage or canage, I don't know, canage, carnage, 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 um, stitch detailing <laughs> throughout the leather as well. So this is more like more of a vintage piece, but you can see that iconic yeah. stitch throughout the leather as well. It's really soft and gorgeous. Yeah, the leather is mould to the body beautifully yeah. it's so nice and do you know what i love i love the triple chain detailing you've got different size chains to the handles yeah um, and it sits perfectly over the shoulder as well so it'd make a nice everyday yeah. tote style bag and we we described it as like the co a cozy bag, yeah it's like a we? cozy bag and you literally could wear this with like an oversized max mara teddy jacket yeah. pair this with it you would look so cool and wintry and snuggly yeah. i actually i'm obsessed with this as an oversized clutch yeah i love it it's, it's really really nice. Nice. yeah it's one of those pieces when I first bought it and I was like, mm, but I've fallen in love with this bag. I absolutely love it. Um, we have gone through, ah, we've got another accessory here for you. Okay. Um, love this. So it's a classic Louis Vuitton um, belt. It's got the Damier canvas throughout. Now for me, I still love the Louis Vuitton monogram. Who doesn't? Yeah. But for something a bit more subtle or you don't want it as logo in your face, this works really this well. Nice. This is really, really nice. nice. Belts like this, I think, look so good yeah. over um, uh, blazers. Yeah. Over the top oh, of blazers yeah. around the waist. Good. Really Stop. like accentuate your waist. They look absolutely gorgeous yeah. and they're just a nice statement piece. The good thing about accessories and belts is you can dress up a nice high street look and make it look Definitely. luxury. Um, so if you are starting out a collection or you know you you want to look more luxury, how cool um, is that? Look how nice that looks. You go for the belts or the statement necklaces or the twillies and things yeah. like that, which last forever. Yeah. They really don't really go out of fashion. And you I can mean, just sell Sabrina's them. the best at it. Like, we'll come in and Sabrina always looks glamorous, but she will come in and her whole outfit will be top to uh, head to bottom of Zara. Yeah. And then she just sticks on this Chanel brooch or this Hermes scarf she yeah. wraps around, yeah. and you just look a million dollars. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. So, uh, okay, let's do this. This one. Now this is the ultimate present. The ultimate. The ultimate present. And I say that because we got them as presents last year from mm -hmm. Sabrina. This is an Hermes card holder or a wallet or, you know, whatever you want to call it. Um, it's in black epi leather, so it's a real classic. But the inside is absolutely stunning. Wait till you see this. Oh wow! How cute. So the inside is like this blue aztec -y silk. Um, oh, it's like so the, nice. the inside looks like a twilly. It's really, really gorgeous. So it comes with the box. It's unworn. The lady bought it purely because she wanted a Kelly. So she she oh, sold it was this. Part of the... Yeah, it's um one of those ones. And this is two hundred and eighty. They retail for three hundred and fifty. Okay. So it's seventy pounds off something that is practically unworn. Comes with the original box and will just make a perfect present. Mm. And again, they last forever. You use them at literally to death you really yeah. really do so it's black um, black epsom leather and it's got that really nice blue aztec interior and it's 280 pounds yeah. and it's one of those things like obviously it's great for us i would it's practical but you could also gift it to 
for your other half. It's yeah. a great present for a male also. Yeah, so, um, definitely. Actually. Yeah, that would be, this would be a really nice present for a man because of the inside. But I think, yeah, that's yeah. so true, actually. It's nice for a man as well. Yeah. Um, the Alexandra McQueen clutch it's has sold. sold. It's yeah. sold as soon as it landed on the website. I was it really was, sub- I loved yeah. that bag. And I've always loved that, that chunky ring design yeah. that they do. It's such a cool thing. It's like a piece of art. You're yeah. going out with a piece of art on your hands. I yeah. love the McQueen. I love the McQueen collection. Me too. Um, I think we're done. I think we're done. Chloe? Um, we have some stylish shoes to show. Oh, Chloe, so yeah. Chloe. Let's do the Chloe first. So, Chloe isn't a brand which we typically buy in a lot, but when we get those really nice pieces, we just can't say no. Um, and this one is gorgeous. So, this is in like a really lovely uh, grey suede and leather. It's paired with yellow gold hardware. It's got this nice big... Um, ring to the front with this big chain detailing it's a crossbody bag which is adjustable so you can style it mm. at different heights and different and um, different lengths the bag's in a good condition there is some light signs of wear to the suede part of the flat bag at the top um, it opens with a pop lock closure and then opens out into four separate compartments this bag may be small but it's really really big mm. it fits so much inside just makes an, a perfect everyday crossbody bag it's also mm. a great price um, the style was called the Fade bag and it is yeah. 420 pounds yeah so this bag actually like makes me like a bit emotional <laughs> just because this Here is my first <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> guys how could it, a bag does make... so this was my first inside of a designer handbag really? was the chloe fade bag because there was a blogger called danielle something i can't remember her name now and she was the first generation of fashion bloggers of oh. like, cause, and she um, and she wore this bag. It was like her first designer handbag. And I was like, I need this bag. It is amazing. And I didn't know bags could cost that much. Yeah. I had no idea. <laughs> so that was like my first introduction <laughs> into the world. Oh, yeah. like, oh, what world am I going to? I need into? to make loads of money. <laughs> so I can afford my Chloe Faye. Well, you don't have to pay full price here. No. You get this for 420 yeah. And do you know what? Chloe is really classic. Um, you can wear them forever ever, and I think this is just the perfect everyday crossbody yeah. bag so yeah and then we'll end on some shoes guys so the red sole we love a red sole here so they're a classic patent bowed shoe I think these are kind of a timeless pair of shoes they yeah, definitely completely and you can wear them um daytime they definitely work well as like a nice little office glamorous shoe yeah but also if you're a person that um wants to dance on the dance floor but isn't a fan of heels then these are just as um nice to wear in the evening you definitely wouldn't look out of place wearing them <coughs> so they're unworn as you can see the red sole is still a beautifully red and then you've got that little bow peep hole kind of detailing it's actually it. such a good price as well Wait, how much are they they're 190 oh wow I mean, they retail for like, I, I yeah. don't know about the pumps. I've never personally bought a pair of pumps, but I reckon they're like 500 plus. Yeah, I couldn't imagine you buying a pair I'm of tall pumps. Tall enough. I, well, I mean, I should wear pumps. I'm already tall enough, so. Uh, but they are really, really cute. Yeah. And I can imagine them with the like a long pair of black trousers yeah. with the bows kind of just peeping, peeping out. out. Really gorgeous. Yeah. A very special pair of office shoes, I think. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> so, guys, that's it for today. Yeah. Thank you for tuning in. I saw a lot of you guys jumping in as the live had, like, kind of been halfway through. So, as we come off, you will be able to um, start the live again. 36 and a half. There are 36 and a half. If you did miss the first part, then click the handbag icon at the bottom part of the screen right now. Yeah. And you'll see a full list of the products that we have showcased today. You guys can get in touch with us on Instagram, WhatsApp, or email for any questions but in the meantime have a lovely evening and tune in to our Dubai live tomorrow definitely see you guys